Hello there guys and uh, welcome back to another lesson. Today we're gonna take a look at the request I got. It's uh, the solo song rocking all over the world. Uh, this first video I'm doing now is gonna be Rick Parfit's part, which is the first part of the main solo. And then I'm gonna do a second video with uh, Frost Rossi solo. So let's get into it. Uh, the song is in C and the chords on the song, the main chords of course, are uh, C, F, G. Uh, I'm gonna, uh, in this video, I'm gonna actually talk about Rick's solo and his rhythm after the solo when Rossi plays his solo because it's not, it's not uh, like the main rhythm. So I'm gonna show you how he, do, he does it on the Rossi solo as well. So I'm gonna play it through and then we uh, put it down to parts. play solo and the folk uh, and of course the last thing I did there you know uh, it's not on song but I just did it to finish the thing well so it starts off with uh, uh, on the G string on the seventh fret. You slide up to the ninth fret, so it's like this. And then you're gonna put your uh, first finger on the eighth fret and cover up both the B string and the E string. So you slide like this. And you're gonna do that twice, so it's you got that. And then after that, I'll play through and you put your first finger again on where you started before. So it's then you're gonna hammer on with your second finger on the 8th fret and then back to the first thing again so it's then back on the G string you're gonna go with your first finger to the 5th fret so it's then you're gonna take your third finger on the seventh fret. So it's and back on your first finger on the fifth fret on the G string. The third finger on uh, the seventh fret on the D string. So D string on the uh, seventh fret and back again on the fifth fret. So the uh, the whole thing now from the beginning. After that, you're gonna slide up your B string, and uh, I'm gonna do it like Parfit does it now. So it's uh, on the 13th fret, you slide up your B string and E string. I think he's using his uh, second finger, but you can use whatever finger you you feel you want to use. So it's uh, you slide from the 12th fret to the 13th fret. Like that. 
So it's. And after that, you're gonna go down like this. Uh, it's uh, the uh, 11th fret, 10th fret, and the uh, back on the uh, on the 8th fret. So it's. comfortable playing that but it's uh, you need to cover up both the E string and the B string so it's oh sorry uh, so it's and back on the tenth row There you use your B string and E string at the same time, so it's then this uh, this is part where you place starts off with the B string and the E string on the on the uh, eighth fret. Then you put your uh, third finger on the 10th uh, fret on the G string and then you take your first finger on the 8th uh, fret and then you hammer on with your second finger on the 9th fret so it Finger you hammer on, all on the same string there. And then you finish it off with using your third finger on the on the tenth fret on the D string. So it's, and then you take your first finger on the D string on the uh, on the eighth fret. So it's, Thing you finish off with uh, the A string on the 10th fret with your third finger. And the second you do, you do that twice, and the second time you do it, you slide from the 7th fret to the 8th uh, fret again. So it's I play whole, uh, I play I play from here too. So it's the second time you slide from the uh, the seventh fret like that on the B string and the E string. So it's the last thing on the solo is just you take your uh, third finger on the tenth fret on the D string, this note, and you take your uh, you take your uh, second finger. On the ninth fret on the G string, so it should be. And what you're gonna do here is go down one fret with both the fingers and do it like this. And it's the same thing here, you can use whatever two fingers you think it's comfortable for you, but for me it's like that because then you can. Easy go around the scale and play other things if you if you are improvising a solo or anything. For example. So that's a whole solo I played through again. It starts out with a regular C power chord, but here it does like this. You, re 
you, you release your E string, your bottom E, so it's loose. Then you put your uh, first finger on the eighth fret, uh, on the seventh fret, sorry. And your pinky, it's easier to have you use your pinky here. Uh, the, the fifth finger, of course, or fourth, I mean. And uh, you put that finger on the on the tenth fret on the D string, so it should be. And all together is. Sounds a little bit weird now, but and then it goes to a regular F chord. And then you see the famous uh, I don't know why, but he does that during uh, Rossi solo. That's the only uh, only place he does play the rhythm like that. Uh, on the, he plays a bit similar on uh, on the when they sing that I like it. On the last, I like it. He plays it like this. <laughs> that and you, if you want what that was, it was a diminished chord. I don't, you know, there are some chords, I, I know the Swedish word for it, but not in English, but it's... Uh... It's uh, your second finger on the ninth fret, your first finger on the seventh fret, and your third finger on the... A fret, and of course it's uh, the G string with the G string. Okay, I will say it again. It will be easier. Uh, the second finger on the A fret on the G string. The first finger on the seventh fret on the B string, and your third finger on the A fret on the E string. So it's. show that but I think you can figure it out it's, uh, the rhythm is like solo uh, or yeah it begins like solo you know but he just plays in a different way like this and do, do you know that part? that's the second chord of the solo so it's just and back here and he finishes it off with on the on the on the fiftieth fret and does the same thing and back again, uh, and back again of course. So I hope you liked this video and please press like if you want because that will make it easier for me to grow my channel and of course share it if you want and, sub and subscribe if you want more. So thank you for your time and.